Here we go, here we go. Look at that, dude. That is so fresh. All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays, and I am back at it again with some more Dragon Ball Z Universe 2 DLC Pack 16 mod showcases here on the channel, guys. We have literally the full mod pack based on DLC 16, okay? We don't know all the characters yet, but I think most of us can predict that Beast Gohan is coming, okay? We know Orange Piccolo is coming, but Beast Gohan, he's got to be coming too. But who could be the potential third character if there is one? Probably not. There's probably only going to be Beast Gohan and Orange Piccolo. Um, what about Power Awakening Piccolo? Yes, the transforming DBS superhero Piccolo that would kind of be uh, the, the, the counterpart to the Gohan version, right? That'd be sick. So we have a Beast Gohan. We actually have two Beast Gohans that we're going to showcase. One by TCG Cardcast, which he did the full mad, mod pack. Mad pack? Mod pack. Big shout outs to him for this amazing amazing orange piccolo okay it's not 100 percent. it's not you know full on but this is definitely the best orange piccolo model that we have the dude put a lot of work into it shout out to any other modders that help contribute we also have a shirtless version which you know we're not going to get that in xenoverse 2 and he also does have a preset where he becomes giant yes again it's not confirmed that he's going to be having the giant awoken scale most likely won't they would have showed it by this point in time but wow this is very very impressive and again, using the DLC 16 assets with Gohan's Gi, you can actually see it on Piccolo's pants. It's the same type of, you know, model and everything too. So uh, this version by Gamer Chief and big shout outs to Coffee for their amazing moves that they're going to be showcasing as well. It's going to be so fun. I'm very, very excited. We've got a lot of new skills. Let's just jump into it. But before we do, guys, do me a massive gargantuan favor and smash that like button. We got to reach over a thousand likes in the first 24 hours, guys. If we do that, I'll do another sick mod showcase. All right. So uh, I guess we'll start off with the Piccolos first. Is fighting me your test of strength? Perfect. I needed someone to test out this power. That was the warm up. I'm just getting started. Thank you, Shenron. That little extra went a long way. Wow, these mods are very, very impressive. So I know Piccolo's in his base, but just wait, just wait. I love it, dude. Uh, camera's a little bit way too close up, but um, we got to really, really appreciate this model, man. I'm telling you, best orange Piccolo mod that we have right now. Very refined, very polished. Um, got the symbol on the back. I think in the actual, uh, you know, teaser, the symbol is a little bit different. Uh, I think this part right here where it kind of like comes up. It's a little bit skinnier right there, but uh, for the most part, this model is, it's awesome, man. I love it, and everything is very proportional. I think that's th something that um, most mods lack with Orange Piccolo, was that his head was usually like, I don't know, too small. Uh, his, his traps in his neck were not bright, uh, and also the mouth. They always gave him an ass chin. I don't know why. For so I don't know if that was like some Mandela effect. Like we thought he had an ass chin because he had like a super chiseled Giga Chad Piccolo jawline or whatever. But um, yeah, uh, everything on this is is on point. Okay, it's it's proportional. Like this is the step in the right direction if you're gonna make an orange Piccolo or whatever. And his clothes and everything look great. I'm so impressed. So uh, let's go ahead and start off with DBS Superhero Piccolo. Um, I believe he does have a new move set. I could be wrong. Uh, usually. Piccolo tends to have um, the stretchy arms in his combo. So that was a square combo. I like the flips. That's nice. Okay, and then he's got that um, like double X cross kick type of deal for the triangle combo. So I like that two, two hit combo here. If I can actually land it. <laughs> oh, I like the kicks on this. Okay, it's a very simple move set. I feel like it works pretty well with Piccolo. Oh, that's sick. Okay, so I was like, I was like, is he gonna do the stretchy arms? Like, where's it coming in? So that was the five hit weak hit combo. Triangle, square, triangle. Nice. I like that. I like that. So move set most likely taken from other characters and stuff as always. Uh it's gonna retain the classic piccolo move set and everything too. Uh limit burst here. Boom. Okay, so I think that is a custom limit burst, if I'm not mistaken. And it kind of gets glitched out. Um, I probably should have read his Super Soul, but he does have like a, uh, a custom Super Soul on that too. So before we get into the transformation, uh, try out some of the skills. So he's going to have, m for the most part, the standard skills and all that stuff. But we do want to transform here because he's got Demon Stone Run, which is sick. Okay, that is an actual attack he uses in Dragon Ball Legends. He used it in the movie. So um, did I do everything? Let me do our stamina breaks and everything too. They probably are... Normal Piccolo stamina breaks, but I could be wrong, okay? Here we go, here we go. Look at that, dude! That is so fresh! I am so impressed by that. 
That is literally... That is literally it. That, that's the animation. If we do get it, it has to look like this, dude. We become yellow, okay? Or like the yellowish green kind of color. The aura looks clean. That feels legit, guys. Like, it's a very quick thing. And it just feels really, really good. And we do have a new aura, too. Um, obviously, he's not going to have, like, a, uh, you know, aura that will constantly be active. But that's so cool, man. I love it. Okay. So we also have this new skill called Special Heat Cannon. It's Special Beam Cannon, but recolored to be that orange color that he normally uses in the movie. Okay. So I think they did a good job. Or the TCG did it really. I say they almost as if Dimps did this. That's how you know I'm very impressed by this, guys. Like, it's, it feels legit. Um, if we did get DBS Superhero Piccolo, he probably wouldn't have too many different skills, right? Right? Um, let's go and check this out here. So, Super Explosive Wave, uh, Light Grenade. Light Grenade is really cool. It got a little bit glitchy there. I'm not sure what just happened. Probably with the cameras. Um, it works better on the orange Piccolo. I'm not sure what happened with this one. Could be an installer issue or whatever, but... Uh, we'll just do a play-by-play. -play. It looks really nice. It's very, very large. And I think it actually has, like, really good range, too, if you're, like, you're really far away or whatever. But I'll show that with the orange piccolo, okay? Now for what you guys want, okay? Demon Stone Rend. It's so sick. That's awesome, dude. So it's basically, um, what is it? Death Meteor or whatever that um, Frieza has. But he's got the pose and everything, and it's just it's just slightly different, okay? It'd probably look better, obviously, if it was DLC, but I'm I'm still I still very am uh, appreciative to, to see this move finally recreated and in a pretty good way, at least for mods. Okay, I love it. It's just fun. You just you summon and conjure up a giant rock. Usually it was like a conglomerate of rocks, but this one is good enough, right? That's sick. I love that. So yeah, animations really good um i want to check if the moveset does change i don't think it would because that wouldn't really make sense because you know they were i can tell tcg was trying to go for um you know the dlc xenoverse 2 style where you know it's just you know what you what you would expect right right um now one difference about this and the dlc is that orange pickle does not have an aura he does not he has like a slight glow to his body but it's not like a full-on aura right right but I, I'm gonna be real. I like I like the aura. Okay, I like having the Super Saiyan God aura kind of active on him. I think that looks really nice here. So let's go ahead and move on to Orange Piccolo's move set. So I think he yes he does have more stretchy arm based stuff, which he definitely needs. I hope he has that in his normal combos. Orange Piccolo. I think there are reused combos probably from Lord Slug, probably from the uh, Namekian Cac, right? But I just like it. Okay, it fits. It's very they're very slow heavy hits, which makes sense for this version of Piccolo. Uh, two hit combo if I didn't already do it just a big slam. Uh, did I do the five hit combo? I, I'm assuming that's it. It feels like it's the two hit combo But like the same type of deal. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking it's the two hit combo like the same type of deal Yeah, I guess whatever no matter what you do he does that yeah, okay, uh, I think that that should be the five hit unless there really isn't one. Maybe it's after this hit. Yeah, no matter what string you go for, he doesn't really have a five hit. Like, the five hit and the two hit combo are pretty much the same, right? Uh, his grab, okay, yes, he does have a stretchy arm grab. Okay, I like that. I like that a lot. Boom. <laughs> uh, did I do the grab on, I already forgot if I did the grab on him. He didn't have, no, he also has a stretchy arm. Okay, my bad. My bad, I was like, I already forgot. That was fast, that was fast. Okay, uh, that was easy. Um, let me do the triangle square. This one's gonna be weird because those are very slow hits. Oh, I like that slam. I just like having the stretchy arms in it, okay? I know it's not super unique, but full-on stretchy arm moveset. Uh, it fits him. I feel like it works. Limit burst. So again, yeah, he's got some custom limit burst. I'm not sure what it does. I'll probably have to go in there and, and view it again. But there is a custom super soul that you have to install separately, right? So... Other than that, I think we pretty much got everything for the move set, key blast attacks. Uh, his charge up is probably just going to be the the following type of deal. Stamina breaks, very very heavy hits, and again, it just fits his piccolo, right? It, it looks good. Um, I appreciate the stretchy arms, and I appreciate how slow and heavy they are. That that's kind of like how it would feel, right? Uh, evil explosion, we just had before. Uh, special heat cannon again. I like the name of that special heat cannon. 
So it's very uh, short range because it's like a smaller super attack variation of it. But if we did get this version of Piccolo or any Piccolo, I feel like Special Beam Cannon would be converted to a uh, super attack because they've done that with um, you know Final Flash for Vegeta and Full Power Energy Wave for Full Power Jiren. I'm waiting for them to do that with Super Kamehameha for a Goku. I thought they were going to do that for some point. But uh, Hero Breaker is really cool here because what it does is it's a counter and it also does give you super armor. Okay, I really, really love that. It's basically kind of like uh, like a God Breaker type of move or um, Strike, Super God Strike Fist or Super God Fist, what, whatever that was called, Shock Flash, whatever the hell it was called, right? But yeah, if you double tap it, he goes for that punch. See, as you can see, there was uh, super armor on that. But if you hold it down, he actually gets that cool cinematic, which is, I think, taken from Wild Buster. I love that, dude. That's so fun. <laughs> That's so fun, dude. Here, one more time. I love That looks so sick. That looks amazing. Look at him. Look at him. He's doing like a sliding Kamehameha. But on the special beam cannon. I mean, not really, but like, I like that he's just going right over it. That's fun, dude. That's so fun. Okay, um, Surging Spirit instead of Max Charge or Ultimate Charge, whatever. Super Explosive Wave. Uh, Break Cannon. So, straight from Nappa. Um, they probably just threw it on there. I, I like it. I think that looks cool. Uh, and then, of course, we have the Light Grenade. So, this shouldn't jack... Okay, okay. It doesn't jack the camera out like it did before. Now... The range of this move is actually kind of nutty. It goes very far. Look at that. Look at that. Like, I think you could be, like, the farthest away in terms of range <clears throat> for this orange... Uh, not yellow, orange. Yellow Piccolo, whatever you want to call him. Go for the light grenade, yes! Look at that. Look at that range! That range is crazy! Like, that's as far as I can get. That's the entire stage. At least for me being locked off like how close can i get to him okay so like right here okay this is the farthest i can get and it'll 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 just track him that's crazy look at the damage too that's nutty bears bro that's nutty bears all right giant namekian yes great namekian would have been so easy if they did this okay not saying 100 percent they're not but i'm just saying it's most likely they aren't doing this i feel like they would have revealed it but we still have no gameplay on Orange Piccolo yet. By this point in time, with the actual character reveal and all the skills, they would have revealed it, right? Uh, short range, Mouth Cannon. You have the long range one. Evil Roar. All that good stuff. Uh, no ultimates or anything for it. I think it's just, you know, Great Namekian as an Awoken. What you would expect, right? But pretty cool. Pretty fun. I like it. Alright, guys. There you have it. And you can run, which is cool. Um, I gotta do the grab probably too, right? Hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's right under me. Okay. Slap him up. So you got your combos, all the good stuff. Yeah, it's just uh, the great Namekian giant turn giant skill. Again, always so fun. <laughs> you just grab him and throw him. All right, guys. Beast Gohan showcases. All right, guys. So we have two different Beast Gohans. The right side is TCG's version. And this one that I'm using is... Gamer Chiefs. Oh, I love this one so much. So let's get into the moveset right off the bat, dude. Oh, yes. That's what I'm feeling it. Yes. Yes. That is clean. That was a five. No, no, no. It was just the, the weak hit combo. Okay, two hit combo here. Boom. Nice. Key blast and everything. Can we just appreciate how good this aura looks? This is the best aura, I think. This is definitely the best aura, in my opinion. It feels very Xenoverse 2 style, but it also has that nice steam on it, which looks so sick, dude. Oh, and the electricity, the red electricity, too. Lot, a lot, a lot of, like, just Xenoverse, you know, vibes on this on this version of him, okay? Uh, Five-hit combo here. I like the kicks, dude. Oh, the elbow smash. That's clean. That is clean. All right, let's go for triangle combo. Oh, nice. Oh, there it is. There's the kick. Ah, oh, coffee. Coffee comes through. Chastisino coffee. I love this, bro. I love that. That's the kick. That's the kick. Violet Beast kick. Um, I hope it's a skill, but if it's integrated just into the move set, I'm not going to complain at all. Okay. Like, if it looks like this, I'm down. I'm absolutely down. All right. Um, I'm only missing the triangle square. Oh, the multiple hits in there. That's fancy. Oh, what the hell? That was absolutely fire. 
That is the sickest shit ever, bro. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Man just snapped his neck. That goes incredibly hard. I was not expecting that at all. That glow that he has. Like, it's so weird. How do I even land that? That's, I feel like that was taken from someone. I can't remember who it was. Who is that from? That's from someone, guys. Or from something. I think that's Ooze Grab. Is that Ooze Grab? I think it was. I can't remember. I'm going blank. Y'all let me know. I feel like that was from someone if it was a different mod. It looked very familiar. Not a different mod, but like a, a base game character. Or it could have been like a, a revamp mod. I'm going blank, guys. Who was that? It's killing me. Who is that from? That was from someone, I know. But I wasn't expecting it. That was very, very cool. I'm, maybe I'm just going crazy here. I think I am. I think I am. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, Limit Burst, um, he has all his same skills. I'm not going to go over. It's all the same stuff. The only thing that's new on him is the full power special beam cannon, which is very, very well done. But again, we've seen like a million iterations of that. Let's go ahead and move on to TCG's version. Now, I think TCG's version of the moveset is uh, pretty simple. It's pretty basic. It's nothing too crazy again, but uh, it's just fun seeing something a little bit different. So triangle combos here. That nice punch. Uh, two hit combo. Nice karate chop. Okay, five hit. I think I, I, think I fucked that up. There it is. Oh, nice. I like that. Little knee. Knee smash. And then the finish it off triangle, square triangle. There's the kick. I was waiting for it. I was like, does he have the kick? Yes, he does. It's not the same, but it's got the same kind of like positioning and stuff. Now his grab is, I think that's an ultra instinct sign grab. Hero protector of earth. Is that all you've got? Fuck you. <laughs> yes, you already know. Uh, Violet beast kick. There it is, as a move set. I think those are the ones imported from legends. Feel like uh, Super Kamehameha, Masenko. Oh, okay. The Masenko is different on this version of him. It's purple, which actually kind of makes sense. I, I don't think I've seen a purple Masenko. Somebody do that. So that's that's actually kind of cool. Uh, hyper movement. Okay, there we go. Hyper movement. Um, you know what? Maybe I'll show this. Okay, yes. The Sonic Rush is different. I probably yeah. My bad. I probably should have showed that. I completely forgot. Yeah. I think the Masenko is the same. Oh, no, he has the purple Masenko, too. Okay, I'm stupid. I'm glad I, I went back and showcased that. My bad, gal. My bad. I thought it was going to be just, like, base game shit. Super Kamehameha. That's probably the counter one that he has. I don't really care to show that. It's, it's just a little fucking counter. Like, whatever. Um, Spirit Slash is red. Pink now. Okay, so they're just recolors. But it's nice to see that, right? The Hawk Charge, I don't think, is anything different. I think it's got that, that like combo type of deal, or whatever. Uh, la 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 la. I like the Sonic Rush. The Sonic Rush is cool. That's dope. Yeah, so I wasn't expecting the purple Masenko. That's actually sick. All right, full power special beam cannon. Again, one more time just to finish it off. And this one right here, I want to say. Is the same, yeah. Pretty much the same. It's maybe slightly different, but I've seen that mod, like this full power special beam cannon a million times. We'll have to see what it looks like in the actual game, but uh, just to finish off with the comparison here between the beasts, okay? I uh, feel like this one is more Xenoverse 2 esque with the shaders and just the colors and everything, but this one right here is definitely the better model, in my opinion, uh, especially when it comes to the hair. Uh, nothing against TCG. I think he did an amazing job with it, but you can see right here. That right there, okay? I know that's me being nitpicky. I'm not trying to be, but I'm just pointing out why I would say that this version is a lot more refined. Look at his hair. Like, that's that's really, really good. So, both versions are great, okay? I like the shaders and the colors on this one, but I feel like this model on its own is just way cleaner. And, of course, you know, the aura and everything is just like... It's just, this one just really good, dude. So, thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, ring my notification bell, and let me know down in the comments which version of these characters do you like the most do you like the transforming yellow piccolo b skull hunter orange piccolo uh comment down below your favorite and i'll see you guys in the next one peace <laughs> this is broly and you are watching slow plays make sure to subscribe
or else I'll destroy your entire planet! <laughs> <laughs>